for these third formers. We want them to come out here and have fun in their first couple of days. You know, a lot of them are homesick. They're getting to know everybody. They're from different parts of the country and the world. Um, so we want them to have fun. When you're challenging yourself individually 30 feet up, you have a tendency to forget about all the other things, all your friends at home. It's just a kind of nice way to be in the moment and be now. And then we put them on the low ropes course and we put them with a bunch of guys they don't know and they have to figure out a problem and they have to solve it and and uh, they can struggle with it a little bit and and it makes for a good time so really fun and challenge are the two main main things we're trying to accomplish and then finally you know to start bringing them together as a form start getting to think think of themselves as as woodbury boys and uh, get to know some guys break up some of those original clicks that have been built up in the first five days of school and i intentionally put the guys together from different halls in order to be able to um, you know introduce them to some new new characters it gives them a chance to try something new. It also gets them a chance to meet people not only within their grade, but in other grades. And so now when we'll see them like walking on a sidewalk, we can say um, like, hey, and how's it going? And they feel like they're a little bit more part of Woodbury. Our job is to make them like come together and know their classmates. And so I think our goals are for them to just become one because this is their fifth day here. And so they really need to learn to be able to work with each other and come together. My freshman year here at Woodbury Forest, I came to the ropes course my first week and I didn't really know that many people. I knew a couple kids, like my roommates, but not very many people and I started climbing up the climbing wall and there are these people that I had no idea who they were and they were just cheering me on, helping me get up and I had kids in my class that I knew their names but I didn't really know them very well, like t helping me out, telling me what to do and it just, when I got to the top, and I rang the bell, so everyone was cheering, and it just felt really good. Like I came here as a timid third former, a freshman. I had a, a senior who helped me out through the wall, climbed the wall, and I mean, it just helped me grow into, grow into Woodbury and helped me become like part of my own. It, it, it showed me that Woodbury was always at my back and that I could rely on Woodbury. It just showed me that I can do stuff on my own now and didn't have to have my parents push me, push me along and get me to do things. They go through a ton of training to be able to learn how to process, facilitate, um, belay, and run this thing. And, and I think that's the glory of it. It's, 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 a, it's truly a student-run program. So first of all, I make sure that they know that they're not going to fall and that they're going to be safe. And then uh, that usually sort of gets them onto the wall, but then they're still a little bit nervous. I just tell them where to put their feet, where to put their hands if they stop and they're asking for help. Um, but for the most part, I want them to try and figure out themselves unless they ask. But if they ask to come down one time, I sort of just ask, are you sure? Or how about you try this? And a lot of times that sort of keeps them going and then they make it to the top and, it, and it's great. 